and welcome back for another episode of my Let's Play Minecraft 1.3.2 with the Archaeology mod, Most Creatures, Pam's mod, a whole list of other mods. You can look at them in the uh, description down below here. Um, last time we left off we were down in the cave underneath of the well, just next to some lava. We're starting to get some redstone so we can work on building our industrial craft machines and get things rolling. Probably, I hope, to move towards the um, new location of where we're going to actually live. I said that like two, ep two episodes ago. We didn't quite make it due to some unexpected deaths that had occurred, which ate up some of my time. But really, we'll just keep pushing on for some more redstone. Um, there's some hanging up there. Of course, playing with lava is never fun. Oh, ran out of some rocks. And my inventory seems to be... Oh, it's gravel. I thought it was dirt. I don't think we're going to make it over to that, so let's just go somewhere else for now. We're almost down to bedrock. It's um, we're at level 12 according to the mini map over there. So we're not quite at the bottom, but we're fairly close. Some archaeology stuff here. Get some more tin ore. And I did not mark how I came in here. Oh, that's right. We rode the water. So it looks like there's a lot of lava in every direction I turn. So we could either... Let's see. Why don't we just go this way and see what we find. Let's just go a few blocks up. There's some... Oh, I thought it was some of the permafrost for the archaeology, but it turns out it was something else. Um, still trying out this new texture pack. Let me know what you guys think of it. It's kind of an interesting one so far. Um, blocks like this are not in the texture pack, so that's why they weren't converted. Um, but it's part of the industrial craft. It's a uh, tin ore. That's not permafrost. Just keep going this way a little bit. I know there is lava over here, as you can see. So we will uh, probably sneak over there and grab that redstone. I think I now have some cobblestone to... Uh, uh, we don't use that. That would be a mistake and a half. We use the uh, cobblestone to get over there without cooking ourselves. get as much as this redstone as we can before going back topside. I believe that's sapphire. I don't know what the um, diamond actually looks like with this texture pack. I believe this is the Pam's mod sapphire. Oh, it was. So let's keep going this way a little bit more. We're about the level of diamonds. They're usually around um, 15 or so. We're, pro we're a little low for that, but sometimes you can find them. we got to be a little bit lower to find the redstone, however. It likes to spawn in the lower areas, from what I've noticed. I don't want to go too far here. A little glitch there. So I'll just kind of go a little ways, we don't want to go too far. I have no idea what some of this stuff is still. I hear lava. Just on the other side here, I believe. I'm not sure. I think that's lapis. 
we can work our way over there. Helps if I put the blocks in the right spot. Let's just dig our way around it. Probably be the best. Or not. Oh, there we go. Don't have a need for lapis quite yet, but I will soon. Some of the uh, permafrost stuff up there. Not really worth trying to get that with the lava right there. Oh, I think we just found a diamond block. Now I know what they look like. Uh, that's going to be a nice little boost of diamonds. If we could pick them up, let's get rid of. Oh, let's get rid of that. I didn't want the cobblestone. There we go. So how much redstone did we get? 48. That's... Might be a decent start. Nope. Oh. Ah, I think I keep going that way. Alright, let's head back up and put some of this stuff to use. And once again, I totally forgot how we got down here. We're gonna ride this water back up, if I can get back in it. We have to do some uh, modifications here. Try not to fall in the lava in the process. Oh, we don't want to do that. Put the crab off here. So we'll just step in here and press spacebar. Try to stay in it. There we go. <coughs> some more coal over there. Oh, we got a mouse or something. <laughs> Before we continue on. Let's see. So we put a torch there to tell us which way we came from. Okay. I don't think I'm lost now. If you missed it, in the last episode, this is where the ogres were uh, ripping everything apart. There's a zombie trying to get at me. And we have to build up. Oh, looks like I already have some stairs started. Just add a block here. But we had some ogres down there ripping everything apart, so we kind of. I had to hide a little bit. Don't worry about that right now. Go back to our sword here, just in case. And once again, I keep getting lost. We put torches and things so that we can find our way, and somehow we still end up lost. what just happened there. I think that fly or bee or whatever that was just killed himself. He gave up. He couldn't find a way out so he just gave up on life it seems. Alright, so we'll go back up here and sounds like it's still raining. Oh, lovely. So we'll get back up here and try to make it back to our little fort thing. Oh, look at that. We definitely need sheep so we can make a bed. And 
I already have one block at the house, but we'll grab another one just because. I will head back and get that bed made. You know, get these monsters under control a little bit by sleeping in the bed. And I'm going the wrong way. I kind of like in the texture pack a little bit. Um, might go online a little bit later and see if I can find some other ones that look kind of neat. And I'd like to try out a few more. If you guys have any suggestions of a texture pack that I should try, just uh, pop it down in the comments below and I'll take a look at it. And probably will throw it in here and do a vote to see which one I should use or something of that nature. Um, still waiting to hear what you guys think I should use to build the house out of. Cobblestone wood or just kind of a mix of everything. Kind of make it look cool. Now we got two horses. I think it's a glitch, like usual. Only one of them is actually the one that's working, which would be the one that's walking around there. Uh, let's see, do I have any wood in here? I do. Let's put... Let's put in here... Let's get rid of bones. Take the wood. Let's see... I'll go ahead and make the bed. That way we got that. Uh, oops, somebody didn't grab the other block of wool. I left that outside, didn't I? There it is. So I will uh, make a bed here. And we can sleep at night. It'll keep the uh, spawning of these crazy monsters at bay a little bit. Starving to death as always. Alright, we got it. Let's see, we need, let's melt some of this, we'll need that. I opened up the wrong one. And then we need we'll do the iron. Actually we need copper for the moment. Had some blocks of copper, didn't I? Got three. That's not gonna be enough. Let's Oh I have some copper already. Well then we won't worry about that. We need ten ore though. Well, we'll do the iron. I need to make another chest, it seems. Like another double chest. Uh, we'll put this one over here by the bed. Let's just empty out everything for now. So we want to keep the diamonds in the other chest. We want to take out the ores, the coal. We'll leave that in there. We got one book. We're going to need that for later. We'll take the redstone out. Take that out. We'll leave the lapis in there for now. I'll take the gold out. And I'll we'll put all that in here simplify things for later, even though I'll probably be wandering around trying to find things. We don't want the dirt in there. Anything else that don't belong? Feather doesn't really belong in that one. Oh, we got nine diamonds. That's good. Um, we need our leather. 
and uh, let's see. Where'd I put the sugar? I think the sugar's outside still. So I will uh, go out and get the sugar. Hopefully that other sugar I planted grew. Did I throw sugar in there? I think I didn't. Hopefully the other sugar had, has grown a little bit and we can... Uh, oh, it's night time. So let's go ahead and sleep in the bed. Nice comfortable view of the uh, cave there. And also gives us a spawn point. Should be nice to have. Now we only need to worry about creepers for the most part and things like that. I don't have to worry about some of those other things. Alright, so we got two sugar. We're definitely going to need more than that. It takes three sugar to make a piece of paper. And it takes three papers and a um, piece of leather to make a book. So, a bit more sand. We don't have any more sand. So, let's go get a shovel. Get some sand. I, where's my sticks? We'll make some. We'll make about. Iron, we'll make some iron shovels. Nope, that's good. Place a dirt block there. Ignore that. So we'll make some shovels. I will put the sugar in here for now. Sugar cane. I think there was a bunch of sand over... Let's see. Some over there. Let's look at our maps. See if we can see. Looks like there's a desert that direction. We'll head this way over to the desert. That's a pig, a cow, some chickens. Oh, there's some sugar that I can go and snag as well. We want to collect as much as that as we can find as we're wandering around, around up here. And if I'm talking too much or not enough or something like that, just let me know in the comments and I'll either not talk as much or you guys can give me a topic I can actually talk about while I'm playing and then I can, uh, I'll do that as well. Kind of interesting tree there. Vanilla bean. Cool. So we'll go over here and oh, there's some more sugar. We might actually get our book made this time. We've only been talking about it for the last few episodes. Topic actually been talking about it since the first one, but been too busy gathering resources. Now we got some. There's another trap thing. There's really nothing in here at all. Just a trap. We'll trigger it. Just because we can. Alright. Enough goofing off with that. We're after sand. And... Grabbing the sugar. Alright, so let's get an empty spot here so I can see how much sand I'm getting. And I'll just start grabbing a whole bunch. I think I am lacking in some. The only bad thing about the, the desert is the snakes. I think I am lacking in some gold, however. I don't think I have enough gold to actually build our quarry. But we'll change our amount of resources we're getting by a lot. It's almost like cheating, but you still gotta pick up the resources to build it, so.
Alright, probably don't need that much, but we're going to take that much. Get a uh, few cactus pieces here. We'll set up some cactuses for uh, defense. Plus, I need the cactus to turn into waterproof pipe for the uh, build craft. Probably start the, my quarry and stuff like that up with the steam engines first. As they could run on coal and um, wood until we find some oil and that type of thing. Then I'll take the uh, steam engines and convert them over to running a refinery to turn the oil into gasoline. And then the gasoline, of course, will be burns longer than the oil will. This is a trap, of course. Gee. Snakes are grumpy. This is a trap. Another trap. Um, it looks like the water goes all the way down, but it does not. And you actually, as you can see, it's you will die. So we won't even attempt to look at that one. We're not going to demonstrate that one, at least not in this episode, unless you guys want me to uh, show you what's down there. I can. Uh, Oh, they're actually fighting each other. Oh, no, he hit the cactus. Um, that's something else we'll need is some rubber. Alright, there is uh, sticky resin. You use that to make rubber for electrical cables and such. Which we will be doing that soon as well. But if you guys want me to go down in the hole, um, let me know and I will... Uh, in the next episode I will definitely empty out my bags and go down there and show you guys what uh, it looks like if I survive going down there that is so we'll uh... oh, I forgot what we are doing gonna put sand down so we can put, grow more sugar. Because we could also use the sugar for um, cooking cookies and all kinds of things like that as well. So we'll go ahead and drop that. And then we will take our shovel and do a Let's see how many cactus pieces we got. We got 12. We'll do a row of 12 here. And then, of course, I forgot you have to leave the space in between each one, so we need to do 12 more. Because of the way cactuses grow, you can't have anything one block. Oops, that won't work can't have anything one block around them or they will not grow. They will actually break off and just be floating cactus blocks to pick up. So I think I miscounted somewhere. I guess we'll find out. And then also this will provide a, uh, goes a bunny rabbit. This will provide a, some defense at the same time. Those creatures will come along and run into it, and cactus will kill them. Nope, I, I did do that right. Take up some. So as you can see, there's a snake over there. And he did not make it. So we'll fill in these other holes with dirt, so that way I can run in between them if I need to. Um, the ogres will ignore these cactuses and just break them completely. Well, oops, don't stand on the cactus. That snake is not happy with me at all. Does not like me being in his territory. Oh, I don't have any arrows to do that. So we got that going, we got those going. Let's make some paper, see how far we can get. Kind of avoiding the snake the best I can here. 
So let's see if I can remember how to do this. We'll put that in there, get our sugar, and I think it was... Uh oh. I don't want sugar lumps. It's not nine pieces of sugar. How do you like that? I don't remember how to do it. It wasn't nine, it wasn't three. It wasn't all these either. Well, that's not good. I'm going to have to look that up and I thought it was either the four or the nine. It can't be a circle in the middle. It's not that. It wouldn't make a difference if it was any of those. Well, we got our sugar, but I can't seem to remember the pattern for paper at the moment. So we will come back to that in just a minute while I look that up. And I'm back, and it seems that um, I completely messed that up. We're supposed to turn the um, sugar cane into sugar. We're supposed to just use the cane. It takes three canes to make a piece of paper. So I completely messed that up. You guys are probably all laughing at me now. But that's all right. We'll go out here and get this book made at least. And so you didn't put anything in there. I know it's not all grown yet, but we need four pieces of, oh, we need more than that. We need three 12 pieces of sugar cane for the books, and then we need another 12 pieces of sugar cane for the paper side part of it. You need four books and four paper in a crafting station. That's what you need to make the um, the book with. So, oh, I walked right past the door. So we will go ahead and get this. Well then, I guess we're give me more than I was expecting. So we need four books. We only need three books. So we have three. We need one more piece of paper. So I might as well just go out and grab one of those. Two more of these. Did I get them both? I don't think I got them both today. Yep, I did. So I'll make our last piece of paper and then I'll put together that crafting guide. Why am I keep walking past my door? So we'll make one more thing of paper. And then it was in these. Well, why don't I get the rest of the uh, stuff here? We got a crafting bench. One extra one. So crafting bench goes in the middle, paper, books, and there it is. Now we finally have that. As you can see it goes through and shows everything that we can make in the game. As you can tell there's um, a few items that we can make here. And then we can go figure out what, what was that? Oh, interesting clock part of the texture pack, making it look a little different. That's pretty cool too. But now we can look up the recipes a lot quicker and get crafting things a lot faster. I don't have to keep uh, running away every time to uh, figure out what we need to do to make what. 
Um, one of the first things that we're going to be making, though, is going to be this. So we're going to need quite a bit of diamond. These take four diamond per, plus three diamond for this, so that's eight, eleven, eleven diamonds. We have nine currently. And then, of course, we're going to need eight gold, and then iron. We got tons of iron, so I'm not worried about that. And then we also need to build this so we can make a pump, at least one for later. Which that's all iron. That's not a big deal either. But we're gonna build this engine first. Just use this is stone gears. And then we're going to also build we need to build some of these, which is wood. And then we're gonna run these eventually, but that's after we get things going a little bit better. So, um probably end it here on this episode. And I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um rate, comment, subscribe, all that fun stuff.